Hey guys, welcome to our Kilivu YouTuber channel. I'm James, a support engineer from Kilivu. Today, let's introduce KRS Pro, a intercom system that can connect all Kilivu products, mobile devices, and desktop devices. A feature with group management and target management, which allowed for multi communication model for user and devices. Let me first introduce the function of KS Pro to you. After installing KS Pro on the server, we can open the web page in the computer's reply, open HTTPS and server IP, A443 ports in the browser, I log into the KS Pro because I've installed KS Pro on the cloud server. This address is the public IP address of the cloud server. Other devices connected to the internet can also use this address to log in. The default username and password to log is admin. The upper right corner of the interface shows the user center and the language selection. Uh, please do not log in with the same icon on the multiple devices, which will cause log errors. Currently, KS Pro supports Chinese and English. By default, the home page displayed the new core main pages. User Center uh, The user center supports authorization service, personal information changes. Uh, user password changes and logout. The left navigation bar supports uh, call management, lab management, user management, operation logs, and about version. We can create a new core, uh, click and enter the project name and click OK to finish. After the core is added, you can search and edit on the core management page. Click the icon to rename, stop, and start the project and delete. The project can only be deleted when it is not started. You have to create and start one project first and all members must enjoy the project before they can be managed to use this uh, mute party intercom system. Member management. Uh, click VV project. To enter the project uh, management page, you can manage all devices and users in the project. Uh, mute or unmute any devices and user. Uh, see them in groups. Uh, devices and a user need to be added in member management before they can be managed. Add a device or user to the uh, project. Click the icon plus uh, to select user or devices in the list to add into the project. And click OK to finish. Uh, click the icon Edit to select the user or devices in the list and then click OK to delete the added member in the project. Uh, Fear the project members. Click the icon and uh, select the talk. A group started. Then click OK to fill the project members who meet these conditions. Add the groups. Click the icon plus uh, to fill in the name of the group. And click OK to add a new group. Click the drop down arrow to show the drop down menu of the inter group. Rename the group and delete the group. Members of different groups cannot talk to each other. Uh, click the blank menu of the group with the left mouse button uh, to move members between different groups. At the same time, on the same page, you can also mute any user or devices.
After entering the group, you can mute the devices and user in the project. It also supports mute all the whole group. Label management. Label are used to distinguish the different functions of the rules in the project. Click the Add Label. Uh, fill in the tag name and click OK to complete. Select the target and uh, click the management icon. Select any member to be added to the target in the list and click OK. The member is successfully added. Delete and uh, edit target. Click the target checkbox on the left and uh, click the delete button below. Member management. Member management supports the distinction between normal user and uh, administrator, which are divided into icon user management, uh, device user management, and uh, uh, mobile terminal management. Icon user management. In this page, you can review all existing icon user, all icon user information, and enable or uh, disable icon user. You can choose permission of the icon. Now we are divided into two types uh, normal user and a core admin. Device user management. In this page, you can view all the added devices and enable or disable devices. Fill in the information and click OK to complete the creation. Uh, the mobile terminal is the new function of the KS Pro. You can add it the most commonly used mobile devices such as Link Deck series into this voice intercom system. After filling the information, uh, click Save to complete the creation. Uh, system log. When there is an error during the operation of the product, uh, you can analyze uh, the error by checking the log to find a solution. You can see the information such as log, start up, and upgrade. When an error occurs, the revamped message will be displayed. Uh, click About Version and select a Firmware Upgrade to enter the Firmware Upgrade interface. After uploading the Firmware Upgrade package to the system, uh, click the Upgrade button to start the upgrade. This is all for our demonstration of GIS Pro. If you have any further questions, please contact our support technology team. Thank you.